Hey everyone, it's Tiffany from Let's Get Scrappy and I have another project to share with you today. This is um, one of my close friend Val's project. She does not do videos, but I wanted to share it because it was so cute. Um, she's one of my um, crafting pals where we do crafting weekends and we've been making a lot of these uh, mini our folder mini albums. So just want to like uh, flip through and show you guys. I don't know why I'm stumbling on my words, but sorry. <laughs> Let's flip through and look at it. This was done with Graphic 45's French Country, which again, um, I just love this collection. I love a lot of the older collections. They're really my all-time faves. But here is the front. And then it opens up like this. Oh my God, so cute. And then you have just some little photo mats in the pocket here. And then you have a flip out. You could do some journaling, add a photo. And then you have a tag. Flips open like that. So cute. So she fussy cut this out. And just did a little belly band here and then again it's another little flip where you can add a photo this paper line is so cute in a pocket with a little tag in it and then you have another tag just right in there and then another little tuck spot I don't know why it drives me crazy when it's crooked, so sorry. <laughs> then you have another little tuck spot on this side. I'm just struggling, I know. And then some more little photo mats or journaling spots. But this um, type of uh, album, folio, whatever you want to call it, is great to use up um, when you have a lot of scraps left. So... It's just a small book. You can make it, this is, um, I want to say it's like four by six. Might be, you know, four and a half with the actual tab part. But you can make it even smaller. I have a smaller version of whatever was left over once I cut these down to six. I have a smaller version um, that I use. So you could have it any size you want, but... It is so easy just to use up your scraps. And then, so cute, little rooster. You have that there, and then here is the back. And this is using, let's see, I think it is three, I wanna say, yeah, three folders, and then to do the top cover, a fourth folder, if you wanted to have the tabs. But I also use, um, from some of the scraps, I just cut my own tabs using my tab punch. So you don't even have to have file folders. If you don't have them, you could just use regular cut cardstock and cut your cardstock into um, with tabs on it using your tab punch. So yeah, so just wanted to share that quick little project with you. I thought it was so cute. Um, so thanks Val for letting me share it. And hopefully you guys like it and give us a thumbs up. And if you aren't already subscribed, please do so. So that way you can see future projects. Thanks for watching. Bye.